Seth Rogen was on Jimmy Kimmel Live, and he was talking about how he got rejected by Megan Fox. Mm -hmm. At first, I thought it's a boring story that's being sensationalized. You know, how bad could it have been? They had video of Megan Fox rejecting him, and we obtained the video for you guys. Oh, my God. Our crack staff has obtained it. We've obtained so, it. So uh, now we're looking forward to it. All right. You got me interested. And it's basically uh, Megan Fox's first appearance on Jimmy Kimmel Live. It's her first uh, televised interview. So she hasn't even become like a big star yet. She's about to star in Transformers. And, you know, Seth Rogen thought he would be uh, slick and hit on her. All right, let's watch. But often, yeah, you have. Um, often, uh, the male guest takes it upon themselves to uh, plant a small kiss, perhaps, on the cheek of the female guest. Right. Uh, as they come out, and I was thinking, like, when in my life will I ever get to kiss this woman? Now's my chance. And so I tried to do it, and to my memory, she physically stopped me from doing it, uh, and basically rejected me on television, <laughs> and, and, that's, and that's how I remember it. I'll be honest, and that's yeah. exactly how I remember well, we it. Well, dug, we dug up the tape because sometimes... <laughs> Well, sometimes you remember these things, and they're not as bad as... I'm praying that I have memory, now, remembering it much worse. She <laughs> asked you to, to she stay. She came into my room and asked me to stay. Yeah. She came to your room said, please stay. It'll please. Make it would make me so much more comfortable. You can fill in the gaps if there's any awkwardness. Exactly. Just interject. Be funny. Okay, yeah. let's see what happens. Here comes Megan Fox. On her, is it her first talk show appearance? Megan Fox. She was good. Wow. You oh, kissed her. Guess, you yeah. kissed her. That worked like, out. Because he's trying to and kiss her. I come in. And then you come in and what? Oh, oh no. man, what was that? <laughs> let's, um, <laughs> let's take another look at that in slow no, motion. No, no, no. And then you go. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Actually. It almost seemed like you were going for an open I mouth. Was, uh, <laughs> mouth. I, was, I just thought I could make out with her right now. Now it's like <laughs> one more time no, because no, I, no, like, no. I like I like when you shake your head. Oh. And you know, yeah, <laughs> that's if my favorite part too. Passes, you nod as if, yeah, of course that's yeah, what happened. That's <laughs> of course it happened again. Yeah. Oh. All right. It, now it it must appear to the naked eye that uh, Jimmy Kimmel's show uh, appear uh, obtained that tape rather than us. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> There's some chance that's true. But anyway, it, I'm glad they said that at the end because mm -hmm. that's the first thing I saw after she like pushes him away, doesn't do it. He's like, yeah, of course that was gonna happen. <laughs> like, why did I even bother trying? <laughs> that was great. Yeah. I love the fact that his mouth was open, like like he's just. Like, going for right. it. Oh, my God. That's so funny and embarrassing. No, but that's why you got to love Seth Rogen. Right. It, look, here's a little um, uh, secret about the industry. Apparently, not a lot of people know, which I thought everybody knew. They set these up uh, ahead of time. They, they tell the host the story that the guest is going to tell, right? I hope I'm not giving away uh, too much here. Uh, so Seth Rogen decided to tell the story. Right. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's why, obviously, they had the tape prepared and they knew what was coming, etc. And, and the host will play along in every interview and be like, oh, really? Oh, so you were fishing? <laughs> like, because they set that story up ahead of time, right. right? So that's why I'm giving Seth Rogen even more credit here. He's like, oh, this will be funny. Let's rag on me, right? Mm -hmm. And then when he does the head bob, like, <laughs> then you're like, ah, come on, Seth. You're a good guy. By the way, Seth has slimmed down a lot. Have yeah. you noticed that? Yeah. No, you haven't noticed that. Guys don't notice that kind of stuff. But he has. He's lost a lot of weight. He used to be Mr. Chunkster. Uh-huh. Seth it's... Rogen. That was his middle name. Chunkster. So, oh, no. <laughs> no, of course okay. not. Wait a minute. Uh, Seth so, Chunkster Rogen. <laughs> so if you're going on one of these talk shows and Seth Rogen's uh, there, do you give him a kiss? Yeah. But, like, I wouldn't, even if I didn't find him attractive, I, w I would still give him a little kiss on the cheek. I wouldn't leave him hanging like that. That's kind of a bitchy move. Yeah, that's not cool. All right. Now we know. Mm -hmm. Now every time Megan Fox is on with somebody, if they've seen this, they're going to be like... <laughs> <laughs> Watching to see if she kisses or not. Right. She's going to be giving kisses to everybody now. Wait a minute. Okay, put some thought behind it. Have you seen all the TYT videos from today? Check out the Young Turks YouTube channel. Do it already.